the medical management of this, I've always been rather adept at, and I've been diligent, persistent. I have a very strong support system, but kind of like the mental accompaniment and just the persistence of learning how to integrate something so complex into just the normal intricacies of daily life um, has always proved challenging to me. And, and part of it, I think, is, you know, just the nature of the beast. Part of it's just also my personality. I'm somebody who likes to do something, complete something, finish something. And this isn't, that's not how you quote unquote win this one. So it's just kind of like learning different strategies and um, being patient with yourself and, but kind of like learning how to just manage that I think has been helpful for me. Um, and then just figure out how to approach obstacles to overcome them. Not, not necessarily look at it as an obstacle and say it's something I can't get around. So that's how my parents always kind of positioned it for me. I found it to be a, a challenging thing to elicit in conversation. I found it to be um, something that wouldn't always be met with a level of understanding that made me comfortable. So as a result, I kind of buried it. And I knew that I had the mental aptitude to manage the medical elements and make it work for any situation I was encountering, even as like a sixth grader when I went out with my friends on a Friday night at 10 p.m. if I have to crush two Reese's cups to keep going, like mm -hmm. that's what I did. And I'd call my dad and my dad would tell me to eat two Reese's cups and I'd just keep moving. So um, that's kind of how I managed it. But I do think incorporating a medical condition into not only your medical care, but your personal care, um, I kind of had to learn how to tell people, which is hard. It's really hard. So for many years, I didn't. I didn't in college. I, I think, I do think it would have been easier if I did, but I kind of learned how many how multifaceted this is in complement to how multifaceted people are and how individual they are in the importance of individualized healthcare and really considering the person and the circumstances that they encounter in order to kind of help deliver what constitutes success for that person.